Let's take a look at Unreal Engine 5.1's UV tools. Now, as you can see, there's on your screen is Mr. Cambato. I downloaded him free from blendswap.com. Information is in the description. Let's get started. So I'm going to select Mr. Cambato, go up to selection mode and change the, the mode to modeling. Let's expand this over and now we can go down to UVs. Now this is Unreal Engine 5.1. You can see at the top of the screen, 5.1. Now let's switch over. This is 5.0 and I already have Mr. Cambato legacy over here. So let's expand this over. So as you can see, there's six uh, UV tools, auto UV, uh, unwrap, project, Seam, uh, seam Ed or Edge, I don't know. X Form UV and Layout. So let's take a look at 5.1. So there's six there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven plugins. So you can, I believe you can actually enable this in 5.0, but it, it was in beta. So here's the UVs. Oh, and the new UVs, it actually has U, was it UDMI support? So as you can see, it fully supports uh, UDMIs. So if you hold Alt and click the left mouse button, you can rotate. If you click the middle, you can pan around and the right mouse button zooms. You can select meshes. Now this is, I guess, this is just one, one whole mesh. So let's see, islands, that's, you can select different islands, that's the lens, triangles, and so on. You can adjust the grid spacing, the snap grid spacing, rotation, I guess that's the snapping, scaling, okay. And there's tools here. So, so you can, I guess you can sew the edges. I'm not going to get too into that. Let's see. Okay. So, let's see. Let's sew those edges. See, okay. I mean, that's a terrible example. So you can do that if you want, but do it the right way. So you can split. Given an edge selection, split those edges. Not really sure how to get that to work. Oh yeah, I think I know that does. Okay, so I guess that's split. I don't know. <laughs> split layout. Oh, look at that. I messed it up. Layout. Repack, transform. Oh, okay. Yeah, it is. yeah, there it is. UDMIs. Yeah, so I think I got it right. Preserve UDMIs. Okay. Repack. Oh, okay. I think it repacked it. Yeah, I think, yeah, yeah. I, okay. Not sure. Yeah, I think it repacked it. I think that's oh, let me cancel it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> My apologies. I I tried to because this model it wasn't originally it didn't have U UDMIs and repack. This earth UD. Okay. All right. It didn't have UDMIs and I wanted to have a good example for you guys. So scale. I guess that's going to scale it up. Maybe. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So you can scale, trans, uh, translate it, flip, change the resolution. I think that pretty. I think this did a. A damn good job as far as the the repacking and uh, I guess utilizing the all right well that's that 
There's the layout, there's the transform, so do I let me let's select that transform. What is this? Applies the translation offset in the positive X. Not really sure what that means. Quick translate. Oh, where the hell did it go? So you want to select that bottom? I don't know. I'm, I'm pressing stop. So. Okay. All right. Oh, okay. So you put the values in there, in here. And let's see. Oh, whoops. Top. Yeah, so it moves whatever units and it rotates. Okay, I get that. All right. Scaling. Okay. Yes, yeah, you know, it's it's trans uh it's translating. Uh transformation origin mode, bounding center, individual. I'll get that. I'll leave that alone. So let's see, align. Okay, I mean basic stuff, but, but I mean, uh, you could definitely use this. Okay. Alignment, anchor, UMD tile, okay. Uh, distribute, channels, not really sure what that means. Oh, yeah. add, apply action, uh, seam, oh, okay. All right, that's cool. That really kind of reminds me of like Blender, the Blender cutting tool. So you can create scene. Auto UV, I believe that's in, that's here. So they, they added it here and you can unwrap. So these two features, they are available inside. So there's different channels. So I guess there's different UVs you can, if there's more than multiple UV, UVs, you can, you can use that display. Okay. I don't think I have any, I guess that's a texture. You can, oh yeah, I remember this. You can apply a texture to. Display grid. Display rules. I don't, I don't have any textures, so. Display background. That's kind of weird because when I, I don't know if that's named wrong incorrectly because display background. Or maybe I, I'm wrong. I don't know. So set you to yet yeah, set you to me to asset. Set Udemy's from texture mm -hmm. material. Okay, so maybe I guess that's the Udemy index or something. But yeah, you can use that texture at. Uh, you can use that material. So if you have a texture, you can add the texture here and. If you have a material, you can use a material. Oh, there it is. I don't know what what it's doing right there. It's going <laughs> going weird or crazy. Okay. Well, check out this video right here uh, for more uh, information on <laughs> Unreal Engine. What is going on, my friend? <laughs>